Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am finally back with another daily plan with me for you guys. I'm going to be planning for the week that is January the 24th until the 30th and I have the cutest winter kit from my shop Romina Rosa. This is the Let It Snow kit which if you guys have been following me for a while you guys know that I actually came out with a kit like this for winter of 2021 and I decided to bring it back as a daily planner kit and I'm so excited to just be able to use it here in my A5 Rings Erin Condren daily planner. That is such a mouthful but yes. So I have all the four sheets I'm going to be needing for this week. So I have the washi date cover sheet A, I have the time label sheet B, deco boxes and decorative washi sheet C and the glitter headers and label sampler which is sheet D. So these are all the sheets that I'll be using for this week and I'm just really excited because I've kind of taken a break not only from planning but also from everything. I don't know there's been so many things going on guys that I couldn't I can't even wrap my head around but I'm really excited to be able to plan for this week because I have so many things to do and it's just a lot of stuff that I'm behind with that I need to catch up, especially because it's the end of the month. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to take out my pages from my rings planner, which if you guys don't know which planner I'm using, this is also from Erin Condren, just like my budget planner. I will leave a link for this down below if you guys are interested, but I really liked using this in the beginning of the month and I thought that I was going to be a little bit more on top of it. So let me... kind of funny to say but like I mentioned there's been so many things that have happened this month that have basically put a hold on anything that has to do with my goals with my anniversary for the shop and with everything so what I'm going to do which I guess I'll just let you guys know here for those of you who watch these videos is that my new year's and my goals and resolutions will now begin in the month of February instead of January because you know everybody does it in the beginning of the year and sometimes that's just not realistic so since this is real life and what I've been going through I'm just gonna go ahead and start everything in the month of February so if you guys would like to join me because maybe you weren't able to do it in the beginning of the year you guys are more than welcome to <laughs> but yeah this is real life guys and i'm not mad about it so i'm just laying down the date dots on top of the washi date covers so i can lay those down I mentioned, i've mentioned this before but i really like how this has no color in it it's just black and white basically i don't know i just really like the neutral feel this planner gives me which is different because I feel like for the most part I've been really into like the colorful versions of the EC planner so definitely something different for me to say so there's one washi day cover okay so we're gonna do Tuesday this week you guys I have so many one-on-ones rescheduled one-on-ones as well as one-on-ones with new patrons i did mention in my um let me actually write this out i had opened up new spots for my one-on-one -on -one patrons and i'm so happy and excited to be able to you know chat with them now so i have two new well, three of new. One of them is Brianna, which is somebody that I already had as a patron in the past. And she's just a returning one. And then I have two other ones, Jasmine and Daisy, who are completely new. So very, very excited to chat with them. As well as I have one-on-ones with returning patrons like Nelly, Caitlin, and Karina. So very exciting stuff here. Saturday. Last but not least, 
Mondays, we have Sunday. I'm also sorry if you can hear any background noise. I feel like there's always background noise at my apartment or by my apartment. So there's not really much that I can do there. So I have all of my washi day covers laid down and I'm going to quickly lay down my glitter headers with the different sections in my to-do list that I like to have. So I am going to split this as always with the priorities scripts so priorities will be like top three things that i need to get done each day then i'll have a habit section at the bottom and then a small to-do list in between and i started doing that in the beginning of the month and i really liked it because i know that it made my days a lot more productive so i can't wait to get back into the swing of things so let me go ahead and lay those down as well as really quick and i think that's gonna be it Yes, so let me go ahead and do that really quick and I will be right back. To Saturday and Sunday. Because like I mentioned, it's the end of the month and I want to make sure to start with like things like my goals and getting more videos up, my budget, all of that in the month of February. So I'm just going to do a little priorities on top. Maybe even habits, but we'll see. Maybe I'll put the priorities at the bottom here so that I still have the to-do on top there. Yeah, that makes sense. Makes a lot more sense to me. Perfect, okay. So, now that that's done, let's go ahead and lay down some half boxes with some weather icons. So I think this week, for the most part, it's going to be sunny or partly cloudy. So let's start with a sunny icon for Monday. I think I'm just gonna do this pink one. Have a low of 46 and a high of 70. I just like how that looks on top there. Um, on Tuesday, we have sunny as well. With um, a low of 46 and a high of 66. Wednesday, it's going to be partly cloudy. With a low of 47 and a high of 67. Cute. Thursday, it'll be partly cloudy as well, with a low of 44 and a high of 71. Friday, it'll be partly cloudy with a low of 
with a low of 46 and a high of 74. Saturday, it'll be partly cloudy again. With a low of 50 and a high of 71. And then last but not least, Sunday, it will be sunny. With a low of 48 and a high of 69. So, perfect. Okay, so I have all of my weather down. Now we can get into the meat and potatoes of this video, which is going to be the daily section. Also, I wanted to mention this because I think these are the cutest stickers ever. I got these from Once More With Love's Black Friday sale, I believe, and it's her Wacky Holidays. I absolutely used to love these back when I started planning in 2016 and I'm just so happy that she still has them available so what these basically are are just of course walkie holidays for every single day of the month so I have some for January February and March so of course I want to incorporate these in my planner just to I don't know bring some more fun into it because I feel like I haven't really been too too fun with like decoration and stuff so of course I have missed most of the month but I do want to start putting these I'm not sure where I'll be putting them down I'm thinking somewhere down here or maybe like wherever I have space at the bottom not sure not so sure yet but yes just wanted to go ahead and mention that because I just love them so much and yeah so let me first start with my training session so i recently changed the time for my training sessions from 11 a.m to 8 a.m on mondays and wednesdays and 10 a.m on fridays which has been working pretty nicely i just started that i believe last week and i really actually like the time change so for my training sessions with my um, trainer frankie i'm going to be using these really cute happy mini um, like Fox and Pig Girl working out there. Look how cute are these. They're the cutest ever. So I'm going to grab some of these and just lay them down. I know these are a little bit like too long, but it's okay. So I'm just going to put her there. I'm just going to write training for all of them. So I train three times a week, which was a main goal for me that I wanted to start this year. And I'm hoping to keep this going because, as you guys know, I'm filming or I'm uploading a series called Fitness Fridays now where I basically just show you guys the workout and everything in between for the week prior and I've been really good with keeping up with that I know I haven't really been good with anything else but at least I'm keeping up with this which is something that I really wanted to um, focus on this year so like I mentioned trainings are this time Monday, Wednesday, and Friday is at 10 a.m. There you go. Okay. 
then let me mark my one-on-ones so i have these and i have quite a bit of one-on-ones usually i'm good with these appointment labels that i but i might have to use the appointment labels as well as these i think so okay so for one-on-ones this week i'm going to mark those with these um whimsical cat studio um facetime stickers so, I have quite a bit actually, let's see. Do this one, and this one because on Tuesday I have two. I only have one laid down there, but I actually have two. One with Caitlin and one with Karina. Out. Which Caitlin's birthday was on Sunday, I believe. So I hope you had an amazing birthday if you're watching this, Caitlin. Okay, so let's like this one on one with Kayla at 8 a.m. and then I have one right after that with Karina at 2 with this a little bit. This 9 a.m. with Karina. Perfect. <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, so those are my one on ones on Tuesday. I don't really have much else planned. Um, of course, I'm going to be marking work as well. So maybe I should do that. Yes, yeah, so right after, well, I'm waking up extra early to start with work in the morning and then I'm gonna bring it down to this side. Mm, I don't know if to put it here or here. I'm gonna put print and cut. So I will start printing and cutting after my second one-on-one -on -one of the week. So let's do these time labels. Let's do these pink ones. And I'm trying to think. Okay, I'm gonna use these Carly Plans cutting machines. Probably gonna be using the blue ones. And I know I have some print and cut custom scripts that I made for myself. So let me pull those out. I've been saying how much I want to organize my stickers, so definitely let me know if you want a video. I could definitely just do it out off camera, but I know I've been lacking on video. So if you guys want to see me organizing my stickers, definitely let me know. <laughs> so here are the print and cut stickers. So let's do cutting machine. And print and cut. Well, that's cute. Okay. I should actually do this for Monday as well. So come back to do that. Squeeze this right there. Bring this down. There's so many stickers going on, but that's okay. And I'm going to mark the time that I'll be cutting or with one of these deco washies. Cute, okay, so that's gonna be Tuesday. I'm trying to think what other things I can mark just so that it's not super repetitive, but that's my life, guys, that's my life. And I'm going to mark on Wednesday the same thing. I'll actually mark it with my orders script if I can find them. Yes, right here. So I'm gonna go in between like using the order script and the print and cut. Just to you know freshen things up. So I should get back by like 9.30. So I'll start working then. I 
don't know if I want to use this pink one. There's so much pink going on. Yeah, I'm just going to use it. <laughs> So that is that. I also want to make sure to dye my hair this day and maybe even film a video just because I think this is the only day of the work week that I don't have a one-on-one. -on -one. So this is the time where I would like to dye my hair. Oh, I could film, um, I'm actually using something different now to dye my hair. Well, for half of the head, actually. <laughs> that makes no sense right now that I'm saying that, but <laughs> yeah, anyways. So on Thursday, I have one-on-ones with two of my new patrons, like I mentioned, Daisy and Jasmine. So let's go ahead and mark those. So I think for these one-on-ones, I will use the appointment labels. So once again, going in with these. Put one here. And another one here. So my one-on-one -on -one with Daisy is at 12.30 and then at 2 with Jasmine. So 12.30 and I'm going to bring them a little bit to the right just because I want to make sure I have space to mark me working because I will be working in between these and before these even start cute okay so let's mark working let's mark it right here should I use let's mark orders And I will most likely start pretty early on Thursday, like at, I want to say 7.30 or 8. I'll just put 8, actually. So, perfect. Okay. So it's going to be that for Thursday for things that I know for sure happening. And then Friday I have my training session and my one-on-one. -on -one, which since my training session starts at 10 and I will start work earlier than that, I'm going to kind of overlap those two together. So let me mark. So I'm not sure where my camera cut off, but for my one-on-one -on -one with Nelly, I don't know what time that'll be, but I'm, I'm guessing it'll be right after my workout, just because we always do like 11.30, so I think that's what I'll mark. I think so. If it ends up changing, I can always just peel up the sticker, but for now, that should be... I think that should be good because we usually always have it at 11.30. So let me just put it at 11.30. That should be the time I'll be back from my training anyways, which not sure why I did it in that color, but it's okay. So those are the main things I have going on. I do have my friend Kim's housewarming party on Friday. And then on Saturday, I believe, I'll be getting sushi with my friends Alicia and Salvador. Although I honestly don't know. I don't know at what time. It's kind of up in the air right now. But for the housewarming, what can I use for this? I honestly think 
I'll be using one of these wine o'clock munchkins just because she did say there will be there will be wine <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and get this one that says mm, wine <laughs> actually I really love wine anyways so let's Go ahead and lay this one down. And I believe it'll be in the evening. So just lay this down here. And I'll write down Kim's housewarming party. Perfect. Okay, so that's gonna be this for Friday. Then Saturday, like I mentioned, I'm going to get sushi with my friends. I just don't know at what time. So I think I'm just going to use... Oh, I said I was going... Okay, I remember now what I said. I was supposed to use the appointment labels for these two. <laughs> okay, so I couldn't find any sushi stickers anywhere. So I think I'm just going to use... I have these... I have these Some Friends Are Family stickers, which is like so sappy for like a sushi date, but it's okay. So I'm going to use this one. Oh, it's not covered. Was I having trouble with these last time? Maybe. Okay, so I'm going to put... I'm just going to put sushi... with Alicia and Salvador and I'm thinking it'll be in the afternoon so maybe I'll get I'll get some work done in the morning and then we'll go I'm thinking like four or five I'm thinking okay so just put that there and then I'll have some time to work in the morning and then for Sunday I believe we're going to my parents' house and we're having some like family time with them. So I will use this bigger box and then I have like a cute little family feast munchkin sticker and a family time script. So that I will use for Sunday. And I believe that's going to be my week guys and I'm guessing we'll end up going like at I don't know what time actually <laughs> I'm just gonna put it around this time but I do not know I'm actually not sure at all but that's okay okay so that's gonna be it for the week I did pull out one of these like dying hair stickers from the whimsical cat studio which I want to make sure to do on a Wednesday so I think I'll just grab probably an appointment label made a little checkbox here with the dye hair and let me check if there's anything else that I have to mark I think that's pretty much it oh actually one last thing I want to mark is that on Monday it is Victor's mom's birthday as well as my Theo Franco's birthday, which is so funny that they both have the same exact birthday um, So I'm gonna mark that. I wish I had more half boxes, but I do not So I might just end up using Some of these labels Do I have any more on the other sheet? I have two here I think I'm gonna use these two so for birthdays, let me just go ahead and use these birthday icons from the shop. So I'll use some there and some balloons here. I don't want to put like Victor's mom's. <laughs> I'm just going to put Lupe's birthday and Theo Franco's birthday, which... I should also mark the Zoom call. We usually have a Zoom call for like anybody's birthday, like anybody from Peru or like my, my sister or my mom's. Um, and we'll go ahead and like sing happy birthday and just like, you know, chat. So I should mark that. Maybe I will mark it. 
<laughs> I don't know. I don't know anymore. Or maybe instead of this. This sticker, I'll just use the appointment label and I'll put the Zoom call. I think I like that maybe a little bit more. So put her right here and then the Zoom call. Perfect. Okay, so I think that's going to be pretty much it for this plan with me now. Really last but not least, I know I keep saying it's going to be it, it's going to be it, and then it doesn't end up happening, but I want to put some of these bigger deco boxes, so I'm thinking that I'll for sure put one on Friday and then on Sunday. Ooh, and I can actually match these. That's crazy. Okay, so I'll do this one here. Probably take a picture with the girls at Kim's housewarming. And then with my family on Sunday. Perfect. Okay, so that for sure is going to be it for this plan with me. Let me go ahead and put my pages back. In my planner okay so this is how the week is looking for me very cute I'm really happy to have set this week up so then that way I just have to write out my priorities habits to do and just check them off as I go these are the stickers I have left over I did forget to mark one work day which was for Monday so I'll go ahead and do that as well but pretty good with these stickers here. I did say that I wanted to use these wacky holidays. So what I'm thinking of doing is, I'm trying to think still. Um, maybe like down here or up there. I don't know. <laughs> I'll do it down here for this week and then I'll see how I like it. So Sunday is croissant day. I'm going backwards here because it's easier than going from up here. Saturday is puzzle day. Friday is kazoo day. <laughs> These are so cute, I can't. Thursday is chocolate cake day. Mm, I love chocolate cake. Wednesday is green juice day. Tuesday is opposite day. And last but not least, Monday is peanut butter day. Yeah, so I think the bottom will work better than maybe on top just because I'm trying to wake up early so I can just go ahead and use one of these time labels the days that I do end up waking up early and just write that in just because it's kind of something that I've been working on but with that being said thank you so so much for watching this daily plan with me I hope that you guys enjoyed I know that it has been quite a bit since I've gotten one of these videos or any videos really up so I really hope you guys do enjoy it if you guys liked this video as always please do not forget to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already and hopefully I will see you guys on my next video. Bye guys!